stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars. Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier owned and operated by corporations. A trip of 10 short years will feel like mere minutes thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. Greetings. Welcome to the Outer Worlds. Yes, this is my name. Yes, this is this is. Okay, those are attributes I decided to take with very high charm and medical and me being medical technician. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Likely bootlickers. Ugh. Initiate skip jump. Status structural integrity down twenty five per cent. Our levels down. <sighs> Shit. Ah, there you are. Wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on Alp have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh, yes, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck!
Can you hear me? Is this thing working? Ah, there you are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes, the smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one of a kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm... Uh, all the colonists are counting on you. Is he one of the colonists as well? That's the first question. Because he seems strangely... you're worried about them oh no don't do things like that thank you yeah Hawthorne should be close by what oh his name is that him oh that idiot I told him to plant the beacon and move away not stand there holding it oh well no sense in letting his ship go to waste oh Hawthorne Ooh. Don't mind you taking his ship better you than the board huh I guess I trusted Okay. Space bar. Yeah, I already noticed that. Thank you very much. Is that part of my obstacle underneath obstacles and go sneak? Oh, hello, little fella. Can I kill you? Oh, you're so cute. Now if I press... no... Adrenal... Hey, give me that... What are those? They're pretty timid, can it? If it's timid, doesn't mean it'll, it won't kill me. Hmm. Easy now. You've been frozen for a while. There's bound to be unforeseen side effects. Okay. But they will explode in them soon, I hope. Ew. Age of vision is more adrenal, okay. Hey, you. Come oh, here. hello. You've tried the best now. <laughs> now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stings. Oh, what happened? We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills, thought I could take him. Then my gun misfired, right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Okay, I'll help you. Ah, looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Sure. And what? It was about murders? Flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed mm. lunatics. With guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? Unless your guy gun misfires again. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I got a better idea. Okay, you look like you know your way around a gun. Got some spare ammo, not counting the bullet in my side. Thank you. You can have my saber too, for patching me up and all. 
All Spacer's choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Yes, nailed it that time. Doesn't sound very really good. Where the hell am I? You hit your head or something? Okay, no. You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. Uh, prettiest place in the Vale. Uh, be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. Thank you. The Hope? Is that some sort of fancy new drug? Are you with Anti Cleo or something? No. Don't take this the wrong way or nothing, but I'm not allowed to fraternize with Cleo workers. Company policy. Okay. Yes. Mm. You are so cute. Makes me want to kill you even more. Oh. Due to complications stemming from being revived after an extended hibernation, your brain processes time differently. Pressing the tactical time dilation TTD button slows down the world, giving you time to think as well as take action. You have a limited time in this mode, standing still drains your TTD meter very slowly while moving and attacking terrain it faster. The TTD meter refreshes slowly over time. It's cute. Okay. You see, couple of red. Some objects explode when hit, shoot them with when enemies are nearby for an explosive surprise. Like this? Oh, what the hell? Oh my. You won't kill? You won't try? No, you will try killing me. God damn it! I trusted you. Double click the jump button to touch the left, right spot. Okay, double. Else. Hacking and picking logs. Your hacking and log pick skills help you get into places you've not meant to be. Mag picks are used to break open logs by pipe and bypass shunts are used to break computer encryp encryptions. If your skill is high enough to break the security, you will see how many mag picks or shunts you need and how long it will take. Raising your skill will lower, lower the number of items used and speed up the process. We need five of those things. There's the third one. Something. Wait. Wasn't the guy here? Oh. Oh, here he is. Oh, well. Hmm. May come back here later. Oh, although I'm pretty sure I opened it last time. Okay, how do I open my inventory? Hello! You can have up to four weapons equipped at a time by dragging them up to the slots at the top of the screen. On this page you can also inspect your weapons, compare them, flag them as junk or break them down to parts. Players with the engineering skill can repair weapons on the screen as well. Okay, so this... Don't know... Codex? I don't like having things... Oh my... Unchecked, so... No, that's not all. Okay... Still not all. No. Okay, I'll check it all later. Now. Drag armor or helmet items up to the equipment slots to wear them. You can also manage your armor here. Break them down, inspect them, compare to other armor, tag as the junk or drop them. Wait. Uh, compare. See. This one. So, this is definitely better and also unique with that. Okay. See one guy there. Ok. 
Can I? Oh my! No, you don't. Thank you. Give me all your stuff, please. Pretty please. I'm taking all of your stuff right now. Because you never know what you may need. Block. One, two, three. Okay. All melee weapons can block. Okay, that sounds reasonable. Hey, get over here before you get yourself killed. Yes, madam. Don't know where you came from, stranger, but you best keep your head down. There's marauders hereabouts, and worse, landing violators. Come <laughs> on, that rung leech. Landing in the veil vale without using an official Spacer's Choice landing pad. I'd slap him with a fine if it weren't for all these marauders shambling about. Mm, so I heard when one of your teammates holed up in a cave. Really? How is he? He is still a moron. Of course I am. I'm a superior officer. Stands to reason, don't it? Just you watch. I'll cross these marauders off with a swift, cost-efficient fury that's made Spacer's Choice the most trusted brand in personal defense. I just, you know, need a couple of winks to catch my breath. Sure, Stretch sure. Legs, son. Uh, those Spacer's Choice guards back down from a challenge, really? Management's real good at cost-benefit analysis. But, seeing as I'm the acting manager in this situation, you know what? You're right. Of course I am. Why don't we cross those marauders off, find whoever owns that ship, and file a full report. Then it's gonna be fucking laminated. Okay, after you. You're doing great. Oh, he's dead. Hey, it was red. God damn it. Nothing on him. Rest the rest. Ooh, oh. Can it furl? Do you wanna talk? Wait, there's one, I think. Yep. There's two of them. Okay. Can I reload? Yes, I can. Wait, you're really not surprised that I'm having the same weapon as you? This is gonna take a lot of paperwork. Okay. So you take care of your paperwork and I'll visit the side. Please be informed that this vessel contains no valuable plunder. Okay. Thank you. Who are you? Unauthorized access of spacefaring vessels is a crime. Please submit yourself to the authorities. I will. Hello, Marauder. I am Ada, the autonomous digital astrogator of this vessel. Please be informed that I am authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. Please return any misappropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. Hmm... Wait, what's that? Oh, I can check the history. Okay. I'm not here to misappropriate anything. I detect an elevated heart rate, mm. indicating dishonesty. Please prepare yourself for lethal deterrence. Okay. Procedures initiated. Disengage your airlocks. Prepare to reject all boarding parties in five, four, three, two, one. Um, we're on the ground. Yep. My deception protocols have failed. I have been programmed to express disappointment. Mm, is this Hotel this ship? Is the registered property of Captain Alex Hawthorne. I am incapable of accepting orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. Okay. Mm. Halter's dead. I understand. I will 
require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. You're welcome. I am programmed to take orders exclusively from Captain Hawthorne. If I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? I think so. I get it. Yeah. Well done, Captain Hawthorne. Thank you. I see your powers of deductive reasoning remain intact. Unfortunately, our engine is currently inoperable. Our main drive suffered a critical power failure, and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably damaged and must be replaced. Oh, I thought I'll find a part like that just sitting here. However, Thank you. The probability of locating a power regulator within a worker settlement falls within acceptable parameters of certainty. High capacity power regulators are sometimes employed in the electrical networks of worker settlements. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's Thank you. Cartridge. Please try not to lose it this time. This cartridge identifies you, Alex Hawthorne, as the registered proprietor and captain of the unreliable. Do you understand? Yes. Thank you. I appreciate your cooperation. You're welcome. Best of luck in your search for a power regulator. Try to stay alive this time. Yeah, guess that's my goal. Okay, and we have leveled up. Let's see. Every time you level up, you earn skill points to spend on improving your skills. Spending a skill point on a core skill like melee improves all of the special specialized skills in that group up to a maximum of 50. You can add points directly to spe specialized skills up to 100. Every skill improves as it grows, but special unlock bonuses occur every 20 points. Read each skill description to see what they are. Are more consumables and statues affecting a temporary rise and lower your skills. This helps or hurts skill checks and the skills passive bonuses, but won't give or take away the skill unlocks. Congratulations! You have gained enough experience to go up a level. Open your character letter to advance your character. Leveling up increases your health points, gives you point to upgrade your skills, as well as gives you access to a new perk in every other level. Keep leveling and you'll be upper manager management material in no time. Thank you. So let's see, am I going to the it won't give me 40. Unlock access to restricted uh, Unlock access to restricted items in vending machines. No, thank you. Medical. Look, the third drug mixing slot for the inhaler. Tinkering cost minus 50. Repair weapons normal in the inventory. This would give me a lot. Terrify, sorry of effect. Scramble. Cower. Not necessary. Unlock power and sweep attacks. Okay, I'll go with this one. Oh, that's me one to each. Okay, so can I redo it? Revert. Okay. So I might add up one. I cannot add one. I don't understand. So told me I can't do that. Then uh, never mind. It's 26 on that, but it gives me nothing. Okay, give me a second, I'll do that, but it might take me some time. Okay, this is what I'm gonna go with. Let's accept those. You can command your companions to use their special abilities on the enemy. You are tar targeting one companion, companion one, companion two, okay. You've unlocked a dialogue combat skill. When attacking the correct type of target, they are automatically something. Oh my god. You get a new perk point to spend every two levels. You can also acquire perk points through gameplay, such as by accepting a flow. Accruing five new perks makes the next tier of perks available to you. So again, give me a second here. Okay, so I took the lone wolf perk. Hope it will be alright. Okay. Thank you very much, Ada. But I guess now. I'll, oh, no. Give me the adrenal. Everything on the unreliable belongs to you now, Captain. Yes. 
Oh, really? Oh, I guess we won't be able to. If your equipment is in need of repair or modification, oh. the Prox 2000 workbench is at your disposal, Captain. Thank you. One of open one more item is broken and a minimum efficient effectiveness. Okay, let's see it then. This one's it's 100, 100. Well, I would rather use this one, I guess. Condition 100%, condition 92%, condition 100%. The hell? Oh, pristine. What does pristine mean? Can I? No, I can't really check it. Hmm. Can I destroy those things? No. Wait, give me a second. I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already know that. But I haven't found anything. Add to junk. Z. 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 I'll ch change this one. This to, add this to junk. Equip this. I'll leave one with me. So this is no modifications, general quests, junk. Okay. I like this. But let's get out of here for now. Because we need to look for a whoa, 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 don't do that. For Say, engine parts. Because you sure walked yeah. in your ship. And if this ship is yours, well ma'am, you owe Spacer's choice a hefty fine. Afraid we gotta dock your pay. Okay. Um I'm a starship safety inspector. Oh, I'm so mm -hmm. sorry. I had no idea we had an inspector coming. If you'd like to speak with my manager, I report to Constable Reyes in Edgewater. Edgewater's not too far. Just follow the road east of here, over past the cemetery. Okay. Now, excuse me. I need to inspect the crime scene before I make my report. Of course. Thank you. Let's run. Do I have stamina here? Doesn't look like it. Ooh, what's that? Detour. I think those are mar marauded. You know, bad guys. Hooligans. Not so fast, not no 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 no. So, did he say supper? Okay, so I can scare them. Some oh nice. Where's the guy? Here you are. Give me your ammo. Where here you are. I had nothing in you, what a shame. I think here? Oh, jewel ring, nice. Can sleep, I don't wanna really. Bit cartridge. Oh, and that's the black edge water. Why the hell they wanna say black water? There's someone there? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'll go there later. We have urge urge mothers to attend to Please stop doing that. Really? Whoa, hey, where'd you come from? From over there. Hello. Running around in a marauder's attire. You're liable to give some people the wrong idea. Why do you say that? It's in poor taste. <laughs> Dressing up like a marauder is disrespectful to all the workers that got eaten by him. Okay. It's safe out here. You'd best head into town. Avail yourself of Edgewater's high walls and low, low prices. That doesn't sound right. Nice to meet you. I'm Alex Hawthorne. Make your acquaintanceship. I'd shake your hand, but I've been hauling corpses. You don't want none of that on you. Name Silas. Junior in humor for the town of Edgewater. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. Okay. 
Working in this place. Trying to in humor. Hmm. Hey, I earned that fancy title. Started off a lowly junior gravesite builder, then junior interment engineer. Oh, and I was a junior burial assistant for a time. It's pretty old to be junior in anything. The rate I've been working, I'm bound to earn a promotion. Must be about 50, 60 burials away from associate in humor. Hmm. Um. <laughs> who, who do I talk about before I go later? Mm, yeah. If you've got business inquiries, you should stop by Reed Thompson's office. He's up in the tower above the cannery. Head into town, follow the road. Thank you. You obviously ain't a worker. What's your racket? You a smuggler? A freelancer? Um, depending on the depends on the work. Is yeah. Company town, board owned and operated. That includes the cemetery. None of us own our grave sites. We rent them from the company. Renting means money. Money means paperwork. Paperwork means signatures. Mm -hmm. Some of our families become a mite delinquent in paying their dues. You see. Okay. You want me to collect what's owed to you? Four workers still haven't paid up. Phyllis, Conrad, Ludwig, and Martin Abernathy. He's a special case. You may want to twist his arm a little. Okay, what's his special case? Look, I don't want to get into it. Just make sure he pays up. Okay, where can I find them? Conrad's got a barbershop in town. Phyllis works at the cannery most hours. Abernathy... I ain't seen him in a few days. His domicile is near the cannery. Okay. We'll find him in town. All except Ludwig, that is. He's over by the landing pad. Oh, well, let's see. Yeah. There's something else we can talk about. Oh, this town must be in pretty bad shape. You could look at it that way, I suppose. You could look at us and say, those Edgewater saps lost near every soul to plague. But you'd be wrong. We're survivors. Loyal company folk, brave in the wilds. You was worried about falling sick. Every now and again, a virulent plague sweeps through our town. That's life on the frontier, I suppose. A body grows accustomed. How long have you been a junior in humor? Hang on, I'm doing some math in my head. Uh, 20, 30, carry the one. Uh, all my life? Work's been real good to me. Fresh air, exercise. Only problem is the paperwork. Can't get anybody to pay their gravesite fees. Mm. Lots of a lot of people to marauders. Former people, yeah. Marauders been raiding my graves, you see. Okay. The armed guards. What are they after? Oh no, they are after the most precious loot of all, Spacer's Choice Company property. If those marauders swipe any more bodies out of my cemetery, company's gonna duck my pay. Okay, thank you. And we get to the edge water tomorrow. Now thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon.